Oh no, is it all gone? Yep. Mm. Oh, I hope I finished it. Okay, today is day three of having a baby. Her name might be Toulouse, it might be Louie. Please vote on the name down below because I literally don't know. But look at her, she's just exploring the room. And we kept her in the room for the first day and then we let her out and she was actually very happy to come out. Normally kittens hide because they'll be scared of a new environment. She literally ran out, she's like running everywhere. She's so excited. Even though our other two cats, Nubbles and Mitts, Mittens is like literally hissing at her, like you guys saw, but she's like, whatever, like she's still exploring. So it's really cute. So this is our little chinchilla baby at eight weeks old. This is her front. Oh, sorry, honey, I know. So this is her back. Her color's like black and like a little golden. Her belly, as you guys can see, is like white and then it's got some black on it and her paws are all black. But yeah, we'll give you guys an update when we take her to the vet. She hasn't had her first vet visit yet with us, so we need to take her in and get her checked up. We're not sure how much she weighs yet either, but I think it's probably like less than 500 grams to be honest, right? I guess we're weighing her right now. We have this food scale <laughs> that we're gonna put our kitty cat on. Doing. How much? 864 grams. Oh, that is really good. 860 grams roughly. That is very healthy. Wait, how much was Nubbles? That was like 400. Yeah, Nubbles was so much lighter. Okay, apparently she's 860 grams. Ooh. So we'll take her to the vets. When we do, I'll film all of that. So I'll give you guys an update when we first take her to the vets. That's gonna be exciting. Get a full checkup, get her next vaccination. That is our baby at eight weeks old. I'll let you guys know how she goes with the other cats as well as we go on, but. Baby number three. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's a destroy. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> you almost did it. But the cats are making eye contact. I'm recording it. <laughs> This is what Toulouse is eating at the moment. This is baby, mother and baby cat, one to four month old food, stage two. We might transition to the jelly after this, but this is what the lady gave us. So I'm gonna finish this off. If it's good, like I think maybe we'll keep it, her on this cause it's like super soft mousse. It's just like, she has a hard time gathering it all. So we have to like smush it up really hard. Oh. Do you want that? One for now. Oh, no, no, no. Nubbles is being a bit sad right now. She has no attention. She's also like my baby, so I have to give her attention or she's gonna be sad. <laughs> okay? So we've been feeding her four times a day. She eats the little can of wet food and we divide it into four quarters. And then we just have grazing food for her. She seems to like the grazing food surprisingly. She actually really likes it. She's been like gobbling it down real hard. So really happy that she's eating well. She's not even that nervous anymore. She's literally just sleeping everywhere. If you have a cat, you probably know like they hide a lot when they're introduced into any new environments. But this cat, she is like so happy to be everywhere, which is like so surprising. I'm really happy about that because she feels super comfortable and because we also have two other cats. So that was a big concern of mine is if she would be okay with like integrating into the new cat family because we have two cats. Oh my gosh, they're coming out. Nubbles! Hi Nubbles! She's still like, why is there another cat in this household? 
Are you complaining? Can I have one too? Oh, thanks, Nubs. Why are you leaving? Hi, Nubs. Suddenly, out of nowhere, she started closing her eyes, and it's like you know when you fall asleep while you're trying to stay awake, and then you nod off. She's like nodding off, so her eyes would slowly close, and she'd be like, "Whoa!" Yeah, but it's maybe she's too stressed to like sleep properly. Maybe she's excited. She's just, I think she was stressed. She'd hide. I was just like, what the hell is this? My no, no, is mature, like, Nubbles doesn't actually, like, mind. It's only when she goes crazy and you Nubbles, Nubbles would go, like... Nubbles is like, keep yourself in line. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nubbles was like, I was the first of this household. Girl's gonna be tired in, like, an hour. She's <laughs> gonna fall asleep. I was just so intrigued by Nubbles. If you put your Nubs. arm down, she's Nubs. gonna fall asleep just Nubs. next to you. Are you sleepy? She looks sleepy. Well, bedtime. Bedtime, right? <laughs> she's not done. <laughs> no. It's always this, she plays, and then she eats, and then she gets tired, and then she'll literally fall asleep in like two seconds. She's like licking herself, and then she flops. The cats have been napping, and they both just woke up. Mitz, I think, is still sleeping in the room, but Nubs and Toulouse, baby cat, has have awoken, so they're awake now. But they're just roaming around. How is your sleeping, honey? Want to drink water? Yeah, drink some water. I bought this for them <laughs> from Japan. Okay, the baby has had a really big day of play and now, well not even a big day, just a big few moments of play and then she gets tired and she'll literally just fall asleep like right on the spot, like her eyes will close and she's like, Ugh. she's like sleeping on the couch right now because she had like a big play session. She's like, I've had a big day of play. 